This program is proudly presented by General Motors Holdens, manufacturer of the big Statesman V8. have to do that and my, might I say a very nice Melbourne Cup Day audience very uh, very and at, at the top of the show I just want to apologize to uh, our floor manager unreservedly move for accidentally accidentally and with no malice of forethought whatsoever uh, stabbing him last night I just uh, uh, now, for those of you who missed last night's show, as part of our Holden giveaway, I had to, uh, well, I had to throw a dart at a street directory held, held, <laughs> held by Merv. And I ask you, does this look like the uh, deliberate act of wanton violence? I'll let you be the judge. I just want to say, personally, the reason I threw the dart at Merv was because anyone can hit a dartboard. No. <laughs> uh, plus, 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 I thought I saw Darren standing behind him and... Uh... <laughs> Merv has bravely come in tonight. I don't want to oversell the injury, but at this stage it looks as though he could lose his left hand. Uh... Or, or arm, or, uh, or even get tetanus and die. Now, I don't want to... Uh... <laughs> Or we'll ever gets the most laughs. I'm not. Uh, I'm not fussy. I think. I think Merv can take some small comfort in the fact that Michael Jackson has put in a small bid for the fingers should they come off. <laughs> Melbourne, are you all right, Merv? Are you all right? It's throbbing a little bit, Steve, but I'll make it through the show. I think. <laughs> start, you, you let me know if it starts to throb too much. Oh, well, yeah, okay. yeah. Melbourne Cup today, and without putting too fine a point on it, I. Hear me predicted the result last night. Now, I know there'll be some doubting Thomases who will say, sure, sure, sure you did, Steve. You're just having us on, Steve. Well, I will let the tape of last night's show speak for itself. Tape, please. So I'm, I may be going out on a limb with this, but I think my selection for tomorrow's Melbourne Cup, and this is just a totally gut instinct thing, Merv, is uh, Kingston Rule will win, which would give uh, Bart Cummings his uh, eighth Melbourne Cup, I, I believe. And I reckon the odds could be roughly seven to one. Oh, it's just a thing. And I also had this premonition. I see this really thick pair of legs in the mounting yard. So either, um, either the Phantom comes second or Fergie's dress is blown up.